I'm Sir Tap Tap, and let's play Sausage Sports Club. This is a very cute physics-based sports game. Um, it's currently on Kickstarter. It's got nine days left as I'm recording this. Um, I believe it has bots. Yes, I want to add bots. Let's just add all of them bots. So this is um, an in-progress build provided by the developer. Um, it's uh, obviously not totally done since it's on Kickstarter. Um, you move around with one stick and you wiggle your head around with the right stick. And uh, you try to... you play a various sports. Where, where is the goal? Oh, there's the goal. Okay. I'm, I'm red? Okay. Wait, there's two balls. There's two... oh man. Okay, nope. Oh man, these, these AIs are very single-minded, aren't they? Yeah, it's a it's a focused on local multiplayer. Excuse excuse you, excuse you. I'm I'm gonna get this goal. No 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 no. Get the get it. Okay, I take credit for that. I obviously had nothing to do with it, but I still take credit for that. So that's one goal for me. Nope nope. Mr. Eagle no. Mr. Mr. No. Oh frick. Okay. See, so yeah, very physicsy based. Um. Oh man. Um. So the Kickstarter. I've been following this project for. Several months now at this point. Ah, focus on the thing that I'm. Wait, AA to slam. Oh! I, I didn't even notice the tutorial, honestly. Okay, so we can dash, slam, and jump. Hey, I won! I, I, I did not contribute anything of value, but I still won, so that's all that matters. That's how sports work, right? Right. Coins. Maybe, maybe do four, just four people. Oh, yeah, there's different. So there's Scout, who is the Corgi. There's Birdie, who's uh, a birdie, Piotr, who's an eagle, and Jaws the shark. Let's play Jaws the shark. Um, let's get a little nice little... Yeah, let's get a cowboy hat on that shark. And there's, uh, is that is that Omnibus? Apparently Omnibus is in this game. Um, but yeah, this game's by Chris Wade. He, um, he's worked as a contractor on a bunch of different stuff. I believe Mortal Kombat X. Uh, is the one, the AAA one, and then there, he also worked on, uh, Manifold, he's working on Manifold Garden, I believe, which, uh, a little bit less known, but really cool looking game that, uh, I don't even know how to describe it. It's very architecture focused. Oh, there's a, there's a thing. Give, give the coins. Um, it's like this architecture focused puzzle game with really cool visuals. Uh, I definitely would check it out if you like just pretty and weird, I think it's a, I guess it's a puzzle game. Yeah, it has it's focused on like infinite space and like you it's like one of those things where you can like fall through the floor and then like you land through the ceiling and stuff so like everything visually looks infinite it's really cool but um, yeah, I've been following the project for a while and that's why I don't usually go on the whole I, I was hoping I could like knock them into the pit but it doesn't seem as possible as I was hoping but um, I've been following it for a while it looks super cute the um, Especially the key art, which you saw on the, the menu screen there. Um, wait, is this not capturing audio? Dang it. Why would you do this? Hold up. I mean, the audio is fairly rudimentary right now, but what? You're kidding me. There you go. Sorry about that. Not, not in focus. Um, let's return to menu. Let's play capture the flag. Wait. Capture the flag with four teams? There's, there's actually a, um, there was actually a mode for four team CTF in, uh, in, um, that seems reasonable. In, um, it was a mod. Everybody's joined, press option. Okay, there we go. Um, what's his name? Wait, what? Why oh, don't you capture my flag, you jerk? No, no. How dare you? What, what do I do? Oh, there. G give me that, no, give me that back. Give me that back. Okay, so it really is four player capture the flag. Okay, no. Okay. Ah, rude. Brr, brr. Give, ah. Oh, come on. No, give, give me, give me the... Okay, no. Okay, so... 
We are at a stalemate. Oh, I lost the thing. Oh, you can't dodge. Or dash, rather. Come here. What? Okay, I understand. Sort of. Oh, no! Okay, so if you touch your flag, it like instantly travels back. And you can't score while they, they still have your thing. Oh, give me. Okay. Freedom. No, no, up! Oh, you, you jerk. Oh, I hate you. Okay, I'm really bad at this one. This one's hard. Um, check out that suit. Wait, but it's paint. Let's be scout. Uh, some bots. Sure. Um, wait, what's I say? Oh, yes! That's awesome. Paint the. Okay, this one I know how to play. Though. Seems like run should probably not be on a button that I might need while using the, the head swing. Wait, how do you get the paintball? Give me, I want the paintball! Get out of here! Get out of here! Get, get... So obviously the sound effects aren't very meaty yet, but you know, it, it's in progress. That's the sort of thing that you tend to do after, you know, you get the core gameplay figured out. Um, it's, you know, it's, you know, it's a Kickstarter demo. It's not, you know, a final product. Yeah, chasing after the ball does not actually seem to be in my best interest. I It seemed like I should just be doing... How did blue... Well, I guess... Wait, does the ball give its own bonus, maybe? I kind of wonder if four people is a little too hectic for this. Ah, oh, dang it, how do... Oh, you can get your stuff back. Wait, 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 wait. I don't know how the scoring system works, because it seems like I... My score doesn't change very much. I won- green one? How did green win? That does not look like a win for green to me. Hmm. You know what, let's try- let's try a one-on-one. -on -one. Wait, first let's do a sumo. Let's do a one-on-one -on -one sumo. Oh, teal team. I'm all about that team. Oh! You can be- I'm all the omnibus. With, with- with a cowboy hat on it. Perfect. Ooh, I like this one. See, obviously a local multiplayer focused game, I can't, um, uh, well, it's really hard for me to, uh, to arrange a, a multiplayer session, unfortunately. Um, so, nah. Oop. No! I have to win this for, t for the teals. For all my fellow teals. Oh, get, get out of here. Get, okay. So this one has the knockback that I was assuming the other modes would have. So we can sort of smack each other around into the spikes. Ow. No! Get out of here, bird. This bird is doing surprisingly well against a bus. I would not I would not have expected that the natural predator of a bus would be a bird. Yet here we are. Here we are! Oh. Fortunately, he is equally bad as I am. The Frick. These AIs aren't really too bad. I, I want some easy moto. Ow. Okay. I like the shuffle mode and the shuffle stuff. Like that should be that could be really good for parties. You know, just press a button and you're doing a different thing. It's like I never liked when it, it's always frustrating when party games like have a really long setup. Like that's the thing. One thing that's kind of annoying in Worms, like trying to pick a good an island that doesn't suck. Like we'll be pretty picky about what kind of map we want, and uh, we'll want to change the visuals every once in a while and stuff. And sometimes that kind of eats up a lot of the time. So it's ow. I'm so bad at this. Um, get out of here. Ugh. I'm really bad at this game. But, uh, oop. If I can get him, like, m my main tactic is just hoping that he falls into his doom. See, uh, uh, see it's, it, it's reasonable, too. It, 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 it seems to be working <laughs> better than my normal strategies. Um, so I'm sure it'll be different. There's, there's, well, you can read the kicks part. Yes! Teal wins! Another win for the teal people. My precious teal people. We are a color everyone forgets, but not today. For we... We shall be the winner. And isn't the, isn't the key art just, so, just the cutest? Um... You know what? I guess we'll just be Scout. Scout is kind of the, uh... The, um... 
The poster boy, I guess you would say. Rawr. Get, no, 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 it's mine. It's mine, it's mine. Get, get, no, it's mine. It's mine, get, get your own. Get your own, did you, did you? All right. Okay, definitely less hectic with less, less people, which is, you know, the way basically everything works, but you know. Ow. Hey. Getting, I guess you need the ball, because otherwise you can't really get the walls. Um. Ow. How is he doing the thing? I, I, I can't smack him away with my neck. I don't get how that works. Other than the, you know, you can do the slam down. Yeah, my neck. I don't know. I don't have the neck control. He's, he's got the better neck control, I guess. Yeah, this thing's on Kickstarter. You can read about it on the Kickstarter, obviously. How does it blue? Oop. Why am I so bad at this game? Oh well. Uh, let's just let's see what the shuffle mode. Oh yeah, that's that's neat. Every every party game needs to just like well, games in general really need to focus on you know the least amount of time wasted. You know, most the best um, you know amount of time between. Yeah, you're, I don't want to say this. You, know, you want the highest portion of gameplay to menuing that you can get. And a lot of games are very frustrating in how much menuing you really need to do, and and loading, uh, like for a multiplayer game. Why can't I? Why can't I neck slack them? There you go. I'm so bad that I don't I don't, I don't understand the neck slap. It seems like I should move them back further than it does. Dang it! At least he seems to usually fall into the spikes when I do. He, he wants to join me in the spikes. This was <laughs> Get, 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 get in the spikes. See? He lo he loves the spikes. What? It's your home now. Go, go into the spikes. Nope. It's not my home, it's your home. There you go. Okay, we're getting back here. We're getting... We're gonna get another win for the teal team. I'm not teal anymore, but I'm teal in spirit. And now I'm dead in spirit. Now I'm only a spirit, rather. That's sort of the gist of this demo. You know what? Let's play coins one more time. And let's be that eagle. That freedom eagle. Red, white, and blue, baby. Um. Yeah, so I guess like four. And see that it goes up to eight. I Does it. Does it support up to eight controllers? That would be great. I, I'd, I'd need to read up on that. Um. He did mention that online is like something he would like to do. It's not currently in the plans, but he said uh, if it does well on Steam or like if he gets funding for it, like a publisher or something, um, it would uh, they would definitely be on his list of priorities. But uh, probably not something to expect at launch then. But uh, that's kind of what you would expect from you know um, indie-focused local multiplayer game. Unfortunately, online it's it's not easy. <laughs> um, it's always fun, but uh, not easy, and it's kind of an issue of like, like matchmaking and stuff. If you're not Call of Duty, matchmaking is really hard to make like work, because like almost nobody will be playing anything but the absolute most popular game after like two weeks. It's it's kind of a shame. I really wish games like consoles and Steam would do better at like helping matchmaking for people. To yep, I I sure do win. Okay, so that's the one game that I'm okay at. Um, let's do some. Let's try some team. Can I? Can I edit the teams for the bots? I don't think I. I don't think I can. Hmm. I don't think I can. Oh well. We'll do one more thing of coins, and I'll I'll be omnibus. With a witch hat. I've been following this game a while on Twitter. The, the um, Chris Way, the developer, has lots of fun gifts on this. If you want to be a successful d developer on Twitter, you, you gotta post game dev gifts. It is the the single biggest reason that I end up following people, is because people love to retweet gifts, people love to see gifts, and people will follow you to see more of those gifts. And you know it. 
It's almost any kind of game will be fairly gifable. Like, you can gif your bugs, you can gif, you know, just funny moments. Like, this game obviously has lots of funny stuff. Um, with, you know, stretchy necks and stuff. You know, lots of games. Uh, well, anything with physics can end up being pretty ridiculous. Um, but of course, uh, you know, just solid gameplay or cool art will also make a good gif. Um, where, I don't know where I am. Oh, I'm the bus. I completely forgot that I was Omnibus. Oh, my, my coins! What have you done? I'm, I'm doing horrible now. Uh, there's too many cooks in the pot. Or, I mean, hands. Or whatever. You know what I mean. But yeah, um... I forgot what I was saying. It happens a lot. I have brain issues. But yeah, anyway, GIFs. GIFs are good for showing off game stuff. And this is Sasha Sports Club. It's pretty cute.